Dennis Sassongweso has been re-elected as President of the Republic of Congo. The Interior Minister announced the results on national television early on Thursday morning. This now means he will extend his 32 years in power. Nguesso managed to get 60% of the vote against his closest rival, Guy Brice Parfait Colelas, who garnered 15%. General Jean-Marie Michel Mokoko came in third place with 14% of the tallied vote. The opposition leaders have rejected the results, saying they will not accept another win for the incumbent. Well, that, of course, a rather worrying sentiment. Let's bring you the latest now from the Republic of Congo. We are joined on the line by uh, Jane Keo, who is uh, following developments there. Jane, of course, uh, it seems a little uh, more of the same then, hey, for the people of the Republic of Congo. Um, these results coming in in the early morning hours. And I suppose no surprise that the incumbent has been re-elected. Well, Lindy, like you rightly said, for starters, it certainly comes as no surprise. The, uh, it was widely expected, widely predicted long before Sunday's election and perhaps uh, even during last year's referendum, October's referendum, to amend the constitution on age and term limits to the opposition and critics. That referendum was literally basically about this day, about Denis Sassoon Gweso extending his 32-year-old tenure. He's done that, like you mentioned there, with that announcement by the Ministry of Interior, which uh, constitutionally is mandated to make that proclamation, the final declaration of the presidential election results. Now, of course, it was an announcement that was made in the wee hours of the morning, about 3.30 a.m., that's 2.30 GMT. At the moment, the reaction, there's been very little reaction to that announcement. Remember, we still have a communications shutdown that is still going on. But we can talk about people now know that their president, Denis Sassoon Weso, continues to be the president of the Republic of Congo because that announcement has been replaying on national TV. It was a recorded announcement that was made on national TV by the Minister for Interior early this morning. And Lindy, those we've spoken to early this morning, a vast majority will tell you that, just, that they are just relieved that finally this is being made public. Uh, they feel that their lives have been on a standstill over the last four days. We talk about not having communication. The streets are still deserted because people were worried and they were concerned about what was going to happen once those results were made public. Uh, a vast majority of them are saying they just they just want peace for their country. The opposition supporters will tell you something totally different. They say they don't believe the results are the right results that have been released. That they believe there's a lot that is that has been going on, particularly with the delay of the final announcement. But supporters of Sassoon Gweso also believe the best man won the race out of the eight presidential candidates. Remember, this is a man uh, they believe um, is widely credited with bringing stability in this country, particularly after the 1997 civil war and infrastructure development. And for them, they say that is what matters. Lindy? Well, Jane, we'll have to leave it there. But thank you very much for that update. Jane, live for us there on the line from Brazzaville.